So you guys were one. I'm hearing all you guys. You guys wanted the theme song shortened, so here we go. This girl reviews movies, games, and books. Sometimes she plays them. So does that. And when she does it with the cat, does that make her crazy? Does that make her crazy? Probably. <laughs> so, it's shorter. There you go. <laughs> Crazy Cat Lady Gamer Reviewer, or Martha Butler, does not own the any trailers or pictures. I use them under fair use, occasional for edge and entertainment purposes. Hi everybody, Martha here. So today we're going to be doing um, the TV series of um, Hercules, the animated one, the one that Disney made after the after the movie was done. So this one I did watch. I think it's the one because I've seen several um, Hercules TV shows. I remember one that was on um, live action. That was this mainly, um, and like went town to town and dealing with a lot of the Greek mythologies. This was kind of like that, except where he was, um, learning how to be a hero from Phil. And it's, it kind of did mess with the con continuity of the movie because, um, Herc, because, um, Hades is supposed to think, well, um, how Hercules is growing up, he's dead because, um, Pain and panic killed him, or as he's supposed to think the pain and panic killed him. So they don't really like by the end of the series, they don't really come up with a way of him finding like him forgetting his memory. So they kind of forget about that part in the in the TV show. Well, the fact that he did not that Hades did not know because he's the main bad guy in this show, just like he was in the movie. So. And we still got, I think the only one that returns, that's when the main, that's when the actors from the movie is, um, is James Wood the one who plays Hades? Like, who else could play Hades besides James Wood and Matt Cartoon? And even he returned for, um, he ended up playing Cam Hart, if you didn't know. And, so yeah. I mean, I think he, you actually get more of him, he's more fun out of him this way and we do get like a whole bunch of other great characters and we get like um Icarus for people who don't know that's the one that flew too close to some we got Sandra we can see the future we got the um the one who ends up um tricking who's um one who the prince that ends up coming the king that actually gets Hercules into doing the um the twelve the twelve trials with Hera in the original one being like a bully to Herc. And I think those are the ones that are like mainly there we do get like get we get to see how like other the great characters we get to see like um Medusa, we get to see um the not thing that happened with uh, the the um the Minotaur the Minotaur. Um and a lot of the other ones. We even get like a Roman um, episode where we get, to, we get to see like the Romans make, make their own gods and stuff like that. So none of the, like, just like the movie Hercules, none of the Greek mythology um, gets brutal as the original um, story does. So, and a lot of, the, and, but they're pretty close to what happens to it, just not as gruesome. They do, t they do kid it down, but they kid down the original Hercules story, so what do you expect? So, this one goes about, like, from, um, 1998 to 1999. Years of one year. I'm guessing about three seasons. So, it was a really good show. It's a really good show if you want to teach your kids about what Greek myth, about what God's names are, what the... This show and the other Hercules shows how I learned which Greek mythology, Greek mythology gods were named what, and the in the same exact thing with that one Roman episode they did. So you want to teach them about like some, some teach them like how to 
with some names you can do that. I'm pretty sure it's on um, Disney Plus now. So, yeah, a lot more better than the movie did. When they re when they were ready to learn what really happened to them, and the and the stories they will learn. So, this was a pretty good it's a pretty good show. And it's and there's also an an episode where um we had a little crossover with hate with um Hercules and Aladdin in this. Um, no genie, sadly. I guess they could not get um even um. They couldn't get um Homer Simpson to do this. Um, Dan Castaneda to do it because. Only, he's only like his hand shows up, I think, in that in that episode. So like him, it, it's like I'll explain this one as I'm hurt. Um, a lot Jafar goes to um Hades when he dies. That's what they call the underworld, Hades, and her um Hades and him find out they both have a problem with a bat with a her, with a hero. So they both team up together and try to stop Hercules and Aladdin. And Aladdin and Hercules beat them. So we kind of had a little crossover. So it was like, that's pretty cool. So I'll see you guys later and bye bye. So this